Colonel Nasser wanted to get the United Nations out of the Sinai for a number of reasons, strategically, by actually threatening the United Nations. He was actually saying to the Arab world, I am the pan-Arab leader. Egypt will lead the Arab world to victory against Israel. He was also laying down the gauntlet to Israel, threatening them, making them also, of course, uh, aggressive, and if you like, um, making the pot boil over in the Middle East to give him um, some sort of a reason for going into Israel and attacking. At the operational level, of course, by the removal of the United Nations, Colonel Nasser could deploy in secret. He could concentrate his forces away from prying eyes and do all the things that he couldn't do if the United Nations were there. This meant that he could push his forces up to the Israeli border. He could um, move to his fortified areas around the um, northern and the central axis and he could prepare his forces for war.